Hello and welcome to History at Arc St Albans Academy. This information will share details with you about the course. Across years 12 and 13 we study A-level history on the Edexcel board. Firstly, we consider the USSR. Students learn about the way that Lenin established communism in the USSR, the way in which Stalin, in a sense, was more radical than Lenin, the way that Khrushchev introduces reforms, Brezhnev led to a period of stagnation, and then focus particularly on why the USSR came to an end in 1991, focusing on the individual roles of Gorbachev and Yeltsin and how this superpower came to dissolve. Next, we focus on Mao's China for paper two. The focus is on the way in which Mao came to power, how he established communist rule, for example, through the Korean War, propaganda, persecuting his opponents, the decade-long cultural revolution and its lasting impact on China, and the way in which the communist legacy lived on after Mao's death in 1976. There is a large focus in this unit on using sources to understand what life was like for people in the 50s and 60s and 70s in China. And paper three considers the end of the 15th century and the whole of the 16th century. Our real focus here on, is on the way in which people rebelled against Tudor rule. There are five main rebellions against these leaders. We consider why each happened, how severe each was, and the repression that the Crown implemented in response to the rebellion. Alongside this, we consider how the institutions of government evolved and developed significantly across the 15th and 16th century, the way in which this enhanced the personal authority of the monarch. And finally, we complete a piece of coursework, which is an essay just under 4,000 words. This is an opportunity for you to get to know a subject in lots and lots of detail and to immerse yourself in historiography about the subject. Our inquiry here is why the Sino-Soviet alliance ended, and you'll read tens of different historians' views about this topic, and you'll come to develop your own nuanced line of argument. This is really good preparation for university, whether you go on to study history or any other subjects. You will reference your essay, and it's marked with a similar criteria as university essays. You can see here some example work that Year 12s have produced so far. And here is a testimony from a current Year 13 student describing her experience so far of A-level history. Lots of our students have gone on to study history or related courses. On the board you can see some highlights from the last two years of Leavers. These include courses on history, theology, philosophy, social sciences at some of the best universities in the country, including the University of Birmingham. I want to leave you with a reflection on our highlight teaching history to A-level students at Arc St Albans. Students are really enthusiastic whilst they're learning about history and it's really wonderful for us as teachers to have students that are so excited and energised by learning about the everyday life of people across history. Thank you for listening.